Hi, welcome to Himani Coaching Center. Today we are going to solve question related to exponents. Now exponents are taught uh, in class 7th, 8th and 9th. Today I am going to do a question which is from uh, standard 9 book. So the question is 3 times 9 to the power n plus 1 minus 9 into 3 to the power 2n divided by 3 into 3 to the power 2n plus 3 minus 9 to the power n plus 1. Before I get into solving the question, let us quickly understand few properties of exponents which would be used here. So a to the power m into a to the power n means a is the base so base is same and powers are different and if we are multiplying it gives us a to the power m plus n similarly the and these properties are uh, true for solving the problems related to exponents now a to the power m to the power n would be written as a to the power m times n. <clears throat> now we can also say if we have got a to the power m plus n, it can be written as a to the power m into a to the power n. Now let us look at the question here. We have got 3 to the power 2n. Now 3 happens to be a prime number. But here we can see that we have got 9 which is not a prime number. So what should we do and by looking at the numbers we know 9 is a square of 3. So what will happen? I can actually rewrite 9 to the power n plus 1 as 3 to the power 2 times n plus 1. And keep in mind this n plus 1 is one entity. So you better put it in a bracket. Now we are going to use this identity. Okay, so what will this give us? It will give us 3 to the power 2 times n plus 1. And finally, this will give us 3 to the power 2n plus 2. And now we are going to utilize this identity which says a to the power m plus 1 equals a to the power m times a to the power n. So this can now be written as 3 to the power 2n times 3 to the power 2. Okay. Now we have got 9 to the power n plus 1 in the numerator. We have got 9 to the power n plus 1 here in the denominator. So we are just going to do this change. Now how will it look like then? So this becomes 3 into 3 to the power 2n into 3 square minus 9 into 3 to the power 2n divided by now 3 to the power 2n plus 3 again I'm going to utilize the same identity it can be written as 3 to the power 2n times 3 to the power 3 so here we have 3 into 3 to the power 2n into 3 to the power 3 minus as we already discussed 9 to the power n plus 1 can be written as 3 to the power 2n times 3 square. Now if we look closely what is happening in the numerator 3 to the power 2n is common likewise in the denominator 3 to the power 2n is common. See the common actually there are other numbers also but for the purpose of solving this question we will take this 3 to the power 2n common and then what will happen so we get 3 to the power 2n now 3 to the power 2n goes so what are we left with we are left with 3 into 3 square which is 9 minus 9 divided by again 3 to the power 2n common so 3 into 3 cube now 3 cube is what 3 cube is 3 into 3 into 3 which is 27 and 3 into 27 gives us 81 minus 3 square which is 9 now what will happen 3 to the power 2n and 3 to the power 2n 
will cancel each other out. We are left with 27 minus 9 divided by 81 minus 9 which is 72. Okay. And 27 minus 9 gives us 18. So 18 by 72 which would be 18 ones are and 18 fours are. So our answer is 1 by 4. Hope this is clear to you. And I would want you to try solving this particular question which will be solved the way we have solved uh, the one which I explained. So try solving this question 3 into 27 to the power n plus 1 plus 9 into 3 to the power 3 and minus 1 divided by 8 times 3 to the power 3 and minus 5 times 27 to the power n. Let me give you some hint. 3 to the power 3n minus 1 can be written as 3 to the power n times 3 to the power minus 1. Okay, or it can be written as 1 by 3 because 3 to the power minus 1 if I want to make it positive it becomes 1 by 3 times 3 to the power 3n. Okay, now when it comes to 27 to the power n plus 1 let us say so it becomes now 27 is what 3 to the power 3 and raised to power n plus 1 what will we get now we will get 3 to the power 3 n plus 3 which can be written as 3 to the power 3 n times 3 to the power 3 I hope with the, these hints solving this question will become easier and you can go back again through the recording to understand the concept properly So that would be all for today's session. Keep watching Himani Coaching Center's YouTube video for further interesting chapters for class 5th to 12th for physics, chemistry and maths. In case you are interested in getting coached through Himani Coaching Center, you can visit our website which is www.himanicoachingcenter to get in touch with us. Thank you.